So I've been thinking about, you know, Jesus, the transfiguration, and what strikes me is that in every count of the transfiguration, we see here in Matthew 17 that Moses and Elijah appear. We also see the same thing in Mark 9 with the transfiguration, Elijah and Moses. And we see again the same thing here in Luke also, this is Luke 9, uh, verse 28 through. And again, it talks about Moses and Elijah. And the problem with this is Moses. Moses is not a historical figure. Um, so here's the problem. If Moses is not a historical figure, then how is it possible that Jesus was talking to him and Elijah as if they were, as if Moses at least was a historical figure. Because clearly the apostles who are there, Peter, uh, John, and James, um, see Jesus talking to Moses and Elijah. They even offer to make tents. So they really believe that Moses is there. If Moses didn't exist, then how is Jesus talking to him? And if, G and if the historical Jesus really thought he was talking to Moses, then he couldn't be God because God would know that Moses doesn't exist.